Visiting, visiting Mr. Six. That's correct. Please come in. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Six, here are your cookies. Hmm. Are some cookies missing? Oh. Oh. Why are all of the cookies stuck together? Hmm. What is oh. it? Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six cookies. One, two, three, four. Four cookies. So how many cookies do we have in total? We can put them together and see. Watch this. Look, here are six cookies. And here are four cookies. How many cookies do we have if we put them together? That's right, ten cookies. We can also divide these ten cookies into two parts, like this. They are divided into six and four. Give it a try. So, I have six cookies. And Thundy has four cookies. Put them together, we get ten cookies. Phew, Mr. Mm. Six, these are your cookies. Don't worry, they're all there. <laughs> oh, good work, kid. <laughs> I have so many apples. Let me give you six of them. They're so juicy. Ah. There's no need to do that. We were just doing our job. <laughs> <laughs> I have too many apples. Please take some. <laughs> the apples are a little heavy. Can you carry them? Of course I can. <laughs> Molo, <laughs> let me help you carry some of those. But how should we divide them up? Watch this. We need to divide six apples into two parts. We can put some in the red basket, the rest in the yellow basket. But how should we divide them? If we put one apple in the red basket, then we have to put five in the yellow basket. We can record this with numbers. One for one apple, five for five apples. So, six can be divided into one and five. To know how six can be divided into one and something else, we can try it out. Six can be divided into one and five. We did it! Now, give it a try. Let's divide the six apples into groups of one and five. You can help me carry one apple. I'm super <laughs> strong. Carry five apples is no sweat for me. <sighs> Momo, stop showing off. Let me help you. Uh, I'm fine. I can do it myself. 